you really think I was going to give you a choice? Um, okay, so, um, all right, so this is the history of downloadable songs and videos in two minutes. <clears throat> It's nine o'clock on a Saturday. The record store is closed for the night. So I fire up the old iTunes music store, and soon I am feeling all right. I know Steve Jobs can find me a melody with one dollar pricing that rocks. I can type in a track and get album names back while still in my undies and socks. Tell me a song, you're the music man. My iPod's got 10 gigs to go. Yeah, we might look for more compatibility, but Steve likes to run the whole show. I heard Desperate Housewives was great last night, but I ate a bad piece of cod. As I threw up my meal, I said, it's no big deal. I'll watch it tonight on my pod. And now all of the networks are joining in. Two bucks a show without ads. It's a business those guys always wanted to try. But only Steve Jobs had the nads. <laughs> Sell me a show, you're the TV man. Steve's got the first TV store. It's a business though, uh, it's, uh, sorry. <laughs> the TV did cost less per episode. But who watches those anymore? They say we're young, don't watch TV. They say the internet is all we see. But that's not true, they've got it wrong. See, all our shows are just two minutes long. Hey, I got YouTube. I got you too. They say Gen Y won't follow news. The New York Times can only stand to lose. If all the papers go away, how will we learn the stories of the day? Dude, we got you too. Make that goo too. Because Google bought YouTube. So bought <laughs> yeah. Okay. And by the way, ladies and gentlemen, a tribute to the RIAA. This is the Recording Industry Association of America, the trade group that's been suing kids for downloading songs. <clears throat> Young man, you were surfing along, and then dumb man, you downloaded a song, and then young man, copied it to your pod, then a phone. By the RIAA, just been sued by the RIAA. Their attorneys say you committed a crime, and there better not be a next time they've lost their minds. And the RIAA, justice is blind. And the RIAA, your attorneys say you committed a crime, and there better not be a next time. Know what? They will sue your butt clean. They say, so what? If you're only 13, and you know what? They were equally mean to an 80-year-old grandma. CD sales have dropped every year. Yes, indeedy. They are quaking with fear. Yes, indeedy. What if there it is near? And we download all our music. Yeah, that would piss off the RIAA. No plastic discs from the RIAA. It's a, uh, what, made it, what a way to make friends. It's a plan that can't fail. Haul your customers off to jail. And who'll be next for the RIAA? What else is vexing the RIAA? Maybe whistling a tune, maybe humming along, maybe mocking them in a song. 